What's up guys, it's Jeff for I Don't Love Blog. Since we do not yet have an iPhone 5 jailbreak, a lot of people have been coming up with different little tricks and uh, tips to do things that you're not supposed to be able to do with the iPhone, such as hide the carrier name, etc. This one, this trick is from a reader named Pim, and it allows you to place apps in the newsstand folder and launch apps from the newsstand folder. I'm gonna show you how this works. First of all, you need your newsstand folder on the second page. You see first page, second page, okay? On the third page, you wanna have all your apps that you wanna move into the newsstand folder. So follow me. On the second page, you wanna place your newsstand folder there right here on the second page. On the third page, you want your apps that you want to move into the newsstand folder over there. So doing this is really, really easy. It may seem a little complicated, but trust me, it's super easy. First thing you wanna do, you want to press the home button, tap and hold on the app you want to move, and then swipe back over to the newsstand folder once it goes back to the first page. So press the home button, tap and hold on the app, swipe over. That's all you do. So you have to do that kind of quick, but it doesn't have to be ridiculously fast just like this. So I'm gonna show you one more time. Press the home button, tap and hold on the app, and then swipe back over once it goes back to the first page. Just like that. I didn't quite get it just yet. Let me show you again here. You're gonna press the home button, tap and hold on the app, and then swipe back over once it goes back to the first page, just like that. So one more time, this should work this time. Got it. You know it worked when the device automatically goes into wiggle mode. You wanna tap on the newsstand folder, hit the home button, and your app will be placed in the newsstand folder just like that. It's really simple and easy. Let me show you Spotify. I'm gonna try Spotify now. Hit the home button, tap and hold, swipe over, there you go. Tap, hit the home button, bam. Spotify is now in the newsstand folder. So you can just continue to do this into your heart is content. Uh, there is no limit. You can continue to add and add and add more apps to the newsstand folder if you wanna do that. It's kinda of tedious, it takes a little while to do so, but once you get the hang of it, it's actually not that bad. Uh, so let me try the Hue app here. Home, tap and hold. Oops, kind of messed up there. I swiped over too many pages. If you do that, just hit the home button and start over here. So home, tap and hold. Nope. Home button, tap and hold. Swipe. Not yet. Home button, tap and hold. Swipe. Still didn't get it. Oops, swiped over too many pages. So you, you can see it can be a little tedious. There we go. Got it. Home button. Bam. Hue app in the folder just like that. So let's try one more app here. Let's get our Flipboard app. Home, tap and hold, swipe. Home, tap and hold, swipe. Not yet. I'm gonna get it here in just a second. There we go. There we go. So now you see the Flipboard is on that third shelf right there within the newsstand folder. So super easy way to get apps in your newsstand folder and you can actually launch apps directly from this folder. And the nice thing about the newsstand trick is that you can store as many apps here as you would like. So it doesn't have any storage limitations. Now, that being said, there are some limitations. While you can move apps around, you can delete apps if you wanna do that. What you cannot do is you can't move them out of the newsstand folder. Unfortunately, you have to reboot your device in order for these to be moved outside of the newsstand folder back onto your home screen. So that is another caveat. If you reboot your device, you lose all your apps in your newsstand folder. So that's unfortunate, but if you're someone who doesn't reboot a lot, then that won't apply to you. Now, I wanna show you one last thing. This is kinda of cool, but this doesn't work as well. You can actually do the same thing and place apps within, or I'm sorry, folders within folders just by doing the same exact technique. So I'm gonna show you right now. I'm try to do this, oops. Didn't do it too well there, but same concept. Basically, let's try it again. On the folder, there we go. Tap, home button. You can see the folders in there, but watch what happens when I try to launch this folder. Yeah, you can probably guess it's gonna crash, just like it did just there. So don't try to put folders within folders, but you can move the folders outside of a folder. So if there's an important app that you need to launch that's stuck in a folder, you can always move it out. So let me know what you guys think about this handy little trick in the comment section below. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.